Hello, my name is Une Parkman. I'm a graduate of class 2024 at ATSU SOMA. In 2020, when I first started off, um, we were the first COVID class. And the faculty actually worked really well to make sure that we weren't um, interacting with too many people, but just enough for us to learn osteopathic manipulative treatments and also clinical skills. And in doing so, they really showed me their passion. And I knew and I could tell that they're really doing everything they could to make sure that we also got the same education as everybody else. So ATSU was actually very special to me because I wanted to go back to my hometown. I actually wanted to become a doctor in Santa Maria when I was a teenager because my grandmother was diagnosed with um, lymphoma. And that's when I felt like, wow, if I don't understand medicine, I can't be there for people that I care about. And ATSU actually allowed me to go back to the place where I first envisioned myself becoming a doctor and train with those that took care of my grandmother at the time. So after graduation, I want to pursue um, critical care. And the reason is I found that I really uh, appreciate being there for people in their hardest times. A very important course I had during my first year of school was to learn about death and dying and how we should approach people at their hardest times. Um, what I hold dear is that death doesn't have to be um, just sad and just detrimental, but there could be a lot of healing um, and you could give people back their dignity at their last moments. So one of the most um, important experiences and skills I've learned is to see the patient as a whole. And with my knowledge and some experience with Eastern medicine, I knew there was a lot more hands-on things you could do with the patient that fostered a relationship, but also fought to find what was causing the illness. And patients also really appreciate um, the connection and they actually open up more about what their symptoms are. And that was very important to me and that's what I, why I wanted to pursue a DO.